Hey guys, Tony here. I just wanted to welcome you to take in the 28 day challenge. And I want to start by just showing you uh, just a brief demonstration of some of the exercises that are involved in the training sessions. Um, first, I'm just going to demonstrate the exercises for the Crescendo 20. Um, and basically, when you do these exercises, the number one rule is you know, don't experience any pain. If something hurts, don't do it. Um, contact me, call me, send me an email or something and we'll modify it in one way. But just do the best you can with each of these exercises. So the first one is jog in place cherry pickers. So here's jog in place cherry pickers. Keep your chest up, keep your belly tight, reach as tall as you can, and just in place, just like that. The second one is speed skate. It's a hop from one leg to the other, hop from one foot to the other. Once you get better at it, you can swing your arms and jump into it a little bit more, okay? The third one is twist in place. Now, it's important. This one can seem easy. You want to squat with it. Keep your chest up, almost like you're in a golf stance, and rotate, 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 okay? You do that for the full time period. Um, the next one is monster steps. It's a big circle with your hip. Make your hip move through the biggest range you possibly can. Go slow and in control with it. Don't lose your balance, but just try to move your hip through a big range of motion. The next one is arm circles. And again, you put yourself in that athletic position, that golf stance, okay? And then start slow and increase the size of the circles little by little until they're gigantic. And about halfway, you can go backwards with it and just keep pushing that range of motion, okay? The next one is uh, casting crunches. You're gonna lie on the ground. Hopefully it's in the picture here. Crunch and extend and crunch and extend and crunch. Work the whole time and don't let your low back come off the floor. The next one is a stepping plank. Looks like this. You start from here, from this position. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. That's stepping plank. A glute bridge. Your back on your back. Hands to your side, flat. Lift your toes off the ground just a little bit. Up in the air. Come down nice and slow. Go right back up. Squeeze your glutes hard. Come down nice and slow. Up. Down slow. That's glute bridge. Body weight squats. Lower down as low as you possibly can. Come back up with control. Down as low as you can. Come back up with control. Do not let your knees go forward. Keep your weight back. Push-ups from your toes. Don't do them from your knees. Not, you're not going to do any from your knees. All from your toes. Start up here and lower down as far as you can, and then push back up. If you can't do that, lower down as far as you can. Put your knees down and collapse. Cheat to get back up. Start again. Lower down, lower down, lower down. Cheat. Come back up. And before you know it, you should be able to go lower and lower and lower with it. Okay? And just wrestle with that. Jumping jacks, chest up, belly tight. Big range of motion with it. Okay? Big range of motion with it. Okay? You can also step with it if you don't like the plyo part of it. And then inchworm. Push up position. Walk your toes up. Walk them back. Walk them up, walk them back. Okay, keep your knees nice and straight. So that's the Crescendo 20 program. Um, do the best you can with it, work as hard as you can. Don't experience pain, take no rests in there, work the whole time period, it's over with pretty quickly. Okay, good luck.